Okay, so thank you, Lori. Okay, so it's Susie. She's black and white dog, and I wanted, I, I perfectionist. I was so stressed the first class. I wanted to do her in something different. I almost changed my subject matter before I came because I was so stressed I was going to mess it up. But I decided to go ahead and not do her in black and white and go with values the way mm -hmm. Susan teaches. And so I did her in purples and pinks and yellows and oranges. And uh, I, I just love her. It was oh, such, yes, a, it was such a struggle mm -hmm. to, to get my head out of the natural colors. Mm -hmm. So now I'm struggling with the background because, uh, well, because everybody does, I think. And so what do I do for the background? I mean, I just really just want to put her on a, on a dirt path with a couple of flowers and well, nothing just, fancy, just yeah. something natural and simple. Well, that's a start, at least you know. But you know, I want to find the perfect picture and just recreate that, and that's the hard part, right? Mm -hmm. Because you can't just find the perfect picture. You have to yeah. find a few things and, yeah. and make it Those right. Those feet are great. You mm -hmm. did a beautiful you. job on this. Yeah. yeah, I know. The eyes get me. Just, they're, they're looking right at me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so this time I brought, I'm going to work on the background a bit, and I brought a, a large frog face. So my goal this time is to use not only not the right colors, but <laughs> but not the same colors. So like a stretch oh. from that. So maybe not all like shades of pink, but maybe pink and orange with the same values. So trying something that's a little bit mm. beyond my comfort zone, even more than this. Okay. So. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you. Thank you. Good job.